It's, it's time for, for questions. questions. Season two. Remember this? Remember this show? Pink socks, everyone. Pink socks. What does it mean if a man wears pink socks? That he's confident. That he doesn't know how to do his laundry. That looks like a Bambi. <laughs> anyway, we're back for season two of Question Quinn. Yeah, because we got a question. Yeah. <laughs> That's all it takes. We're in a tiny little town called Du Bois. Du Bois, in Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Yeah. It's about a three hour drive from Scranton. Yeah, that's why we're not at the same house right now. Different same picture, couch, different, different couch. place. <laughs> same couch and different place. <laughs> Speaking of which, are we answering a question from someone? Yes, but oh, first of all, yeah. we've got some really so, good question for you guys. Yeah, we have a really good one coming but up. But let's go with the first. Okay, the first question comes from Robert T. Do some daily vlogs. What happened to your question Tuesdays? Who has the time to do daily vlogs? I don't understand. You have no life when you do a daily vlog. Yeah, I tried to do daily vlogs for one week on my business channel. And I lasted four days because the whole day you're filming your stuff, but then at night time, which is when we usually hang out and You're have my editing. last time, you have to edit, so it's like, so why would you do that? So it's almost like I didn't even get to see my yamo, so I lasted four days. So. I feel like you'd be on work 12 hours at least. I feel, I feel like you're on in front of the camera all the time. Mm -hmm. And then you're constantly worrying about your next shot mm -hmm. and how to stitch it together. And then you actually have to edit it. Yeah. Anyway. But then I was also thinking maybe he just meant just more day-to-day -day stuff instead of all our travel stuff. Yeah. I think our Japan trip got a little boring near the end. Like we, yeah. It was a lot for you guys to get yeah. through. So thanks for watching those though. Yeah. Now that's the first part of his question answered. And then and second the part, question, what happened to your part? question Tuesdays? Well... <laughs> Never happened, that's why. First of all, it was question Wednesdays, but... And that's then we like, already that's like it. someone asking Samuel L. Jackson, Hey Samuel L. Jackson, why don't you do more of the narration? <laughs> we didn't do Question, question Tuesdays. Tuesdays. How Same. dare you, Robert T. <laughs> Just kidding though, we don't want to be mean to him because he well, he's an old school viewer. Is that a good intent? <laughs> High five there. Why we haven't done Question Wednesday in a while? Because Babu's been extremely busy with work and we've been doing a lot of traveling. Oh yeah, and then our YouTube channel dipped because of the subscriber issue. Remember the viewer issue? Because less people are seeing it, so they're not commenting. Oh yeah, it's so like, it grows, 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 and then the day, and then boom, <laughs> like stops, and then it's flatlined. Fifty percent of our views were from suggested videos, and now it's dropped down to like six yeah. percent. And when we reached out to YouTube, they even said like, "Whoa, that is a huge drop," but we don't know why. Blah blah blah, I'll show you down. It was when I put the video up about that girl who wore the Asian dress. Yeah. Where were we? Sorry, yeah, so anyway. Yeah, that's so why uh, we didn't have enough. So questions. we didn't have enough viewers, so we were, weren't getting as many questions as we used to because yeah. the viewers and then, we weren't and then getting we shown it, to people. Then Debo found all the travel footage and we're like, oh, we might as well so we use it. So we just used up our old travel So footage. as you guys can see, you guys can take a look at those a videos lot of if not our already. Our Japanese honeymoon from 2017. <laughs> So here we are. Thanks for the question, Robert T. We appreciate Great your question. loyalty. We appreciate it. Loyal. All you loyal people T. and and the and the few new subscribers we have been getting, we appreciate you guys so much. You have no idea. Yeah, I feel like. But I am for pretty me, shocked the, that people even the have YouTube the YouTube forces are obviously against us, and yeah. I know that we have people that don't like us. Yeah. And so but to have okay, like have the one or two like. subscribers that support us means like it's not it doesn't count as one vote. It, it counts, counts as like a thousand. Yeah, and a also lot. it means you're a very special person if you subscribe to us because we're fudging weird and we know <laughs> it, and so it takes a special kind of person with a special kind of humor yeah. to subscribe to us. So we love you guys. Legit. Legit. Too legit to quite. Okay. Speaking of hip hop, you want to show them your hip hop dancing? Sure. <laughs> hip hop dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed that. <laughs> Click like if you like that one. Next question comes oh, from. Oh, yeah, you guys. So. If you haven't seen some of our other videos about Look at the playlist <gasps> We the Kim Complainers We the Complainers We made a whole bunch There was I don't Drama's not the right word But it was fun YouTube I don't know It wasn't even uh, I find them annoying They're freaking <laughs> There's just this YouTube couple that we hate 
because they're so fake and they pretend to be they pretend to be so great and so Christian and, and so wonderful, but they're actually horrible, fake, fake, they're, fake, they're, fake they're, people. They're, and they talk about how I've worked so hard for everything in my life. I really feel like everything in my life I've really, really worked hard for and struggled for and I would just love if this could be one thing that we didn't have to work so hard for. Now, just before we left for Japan, we got even crazier news. My dad told me that he and my mom wanted to give us one of their condos in downtown Vancouver. To me, I feel like they're very privileged people. Mm -hmm. They have a great life and uh, all they do is focus on the negative stuff. Yes! On one hand, we'd be living in a nice place with two bedrooms, but on the other hand, with every change, there are gains and losses. So thinking about being further away from my family, just moving and so many changes, I also found that I started to feel a bit grumpy because I already started to miss our old place. So, They have yeah. an amazing life. But I just want one on thing to be easy. Yeah. <laughs> but then it's interesting because that's their thing, right? They have to focus on the sad stuff and they feel like if they don't, then they're not being realistic. But the fact is, is that they're being so fake when they're focusing on anything yeah. that they're not being realistic, period. Anyway, they came and reached out and uh, gave us a the question for us so, to answer. So this question comes from We The Kims and he says, what are your thoughts around the purpose of life and happiness? You know, I have to say, kudos to you, We The Kims, for asking us a question. It really takes a person of taking the high road to ask us this question. Nicely done. Honestly, they just posted this question on one of their own videos, but we consider it a question to us because it's a question to everybody. <laughs> so, what are your thoughts around the purpose of life and happiness? This. This is what we live for. Okay. Hook the leg. Floral <laughs> 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 hug. <laughs> Look at the camera. Floral <laughs> hug. <laughs> Don't live for happiness. <laughs> Don't marry for happiness. Happiness will only make you unhappy. <laughs> Reverse. Reverse! Watch your elbow. Okay. There you go. Reverse! Reverse! Roll hug! Ugh! <laughs> <laughs> Reverse! Roll hug! <laughs> Don't live for happiness! What do you think, BB-8? <laughs> Don't live for happiness! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Really, really, is a day in the life of Yamal and Devo. Happiness is of the devil. Don't listen to the wolf in sheep's clothing. Right, Papa? Allergy season? Allergy season? We just got a comment, some lady making fun of our voices. But, it's always allergy season when you're high on cocaine. Spoiler alert, we've never done any drugs then, ever. Besides ibuprofen and caffeine. Say goodbye, BB-8. What is it? Is that roll floor hugging? Oh. <laughs> Where did that question come from? Which video was that? Probably of like his don't live for happiness video. I feel like they really switched themes lately. They went from all happiness stuff because you yeah, look at their all happy if you look at the first year of their marriage. Yeah, they were like it was being really really silly happy and, and they go travel and then they go do all these doing fun things. silly things and, and then, then overall like, like the tone kind of got more and more negative and complaining. And happiness is not a bad thing. Just so everyone knows, it's good to strive for happiness. Anyone who tells you not to strive for happiness has something wrong with them. I don't know why. Is there's nothing wrong to go after happiness? If someone makes you happy, there's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. You should look for someone who makes you like, happy. No one is that, that dumb idiotic. to think that life is always Only happy. about happiness. Like, there are natural fluctuations, but you always want to aim. That's common sense, but aim for and happiness. And stay in that hemisphere. Yeah, like I what's the point of, fine. like if you're not aiming to be happy and to improve your life and make yourself happy and your 
significant other happy, then you're doing it wrong. That's like saying don't aim for being healthy. Yeah, it's like... Because you're never going to be healthy all your life. Yeah, yeah. Don't try to be healthy. <laughs> Right? That's, right? It's like setting this unrealistic expectation for you to be healthy. Yeah. No, that's a good expectation of to have. You and you, you're not going to hit it every time, but it's a pretty It's something good to strive target. for. It's, it's a pretty good Yeah, target. if you're looking for anyway. any target, your target better be something positive <laughs> like health and happiness. Their old videos yeah. were actually interesting and fun to watch, and then it just. Oh, huh? we should tell people about that thing we got from that message about. That guy who found oh, something yeah, on yeah. Reddit. Oh yeah, yeah. We'll do that on a, a video. Oh man, we're gonna save this. If for... you know this thing about us and we the Kims, you'll want to watch our next video. Someone sent our us next something... question. Question. Yeah, there. someone sent us this insane thing online. Speaking of their negativity. Yeah. But so anyway, we'll, we'll share, share it with you guys next, next time. time. Oh, and yeah, put that's... a comment to let us know you want to see that. If you guys have any things that you find around the web that you want us to talk about or comment on or funny videos or whatever, just let us know and we'll like watch things and react. We'll yamify it. Yeah, we'll yamify it. Yam -fi it. Yam it up! That means you take a yam and you boil it and you go like this all over it. <laughs> That's what we did to Thanksgiving. We yammed it up. Is that funny? <laughs> it was to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, uh, Is that it? yeah, that's it. That's what that's happiness means to us. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Okay. Anyway, that's it. So, we're ranting now. We're yeah, ranting. we're ranting too much in San The fumes crazy. in this hotel room. It's true. The windows <laughs> don't open. So, oh, and there was a crazy thunder and lightning storm, and yeah, I'll show you tornado a little warnings. You'll see all this stuff. <laughs> you got that right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> voices. Yeah, the air in here is not very good and it's making us like, ooh, <laughs> All right. Oh, but thanks Thank for the question, We thanks. The Kims. Thanks, We The Kims. We appreciate good it. Good for you guys for reaching out and asking us. Yeah. A small channel like ours that yeah. are way below you guys. We're so below and you. for the, the fact that you guys reached out and actually said something was really helpful. Yeah, That's thanks, cool. guys. <laughs> <laughs> they probably like, yeah, we are. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> not realizing we're being sarcastic. It's not good for their narcissism. Stoking the flames of narcissism within them. Alright guys, that's it for Question Wednesday. Yep, thanks. Keep the for questions watching. coming. Yeah, ask more questions. We need more and, questions uh, to keep yeah. it alive. Thanks, Robert T. I'll see you next time. See you next time. Goodbye. Can you put a rainbow on my hand? <laughs> Ding.